Well, welcome to day six of our daily reflections on finding direction from God. And we're going to be looking at clarity in community today. And Proverbs 15.22 highlights the importance of seeking counsel from others when making decisions. While it's easy to feel like we need to figure things out on our own, especially in seasons of transition, this verse reminds us that God often speaks through people around us and through trusted mentors, friends, leaders who share in our faith journey. And there was a time in our lives when we were unsure about the next steps of our calling and we still are a little bit that we wrestled internally, praying that and seeking for God's direction. But we still feel a little unclear. So it isn't until we start opening up to others, people that we trust for, the wisdom, for their wisdom and discernment, that clarity can begin to emerge. Their perspectives and encouragement and even the challenges can help us to see things from angles that we hadn't even considered. And in those conversations, we can realise that God is using them to guide us. And one of the greatest blessings in our faith journey is that we don't have to navigate it alone. You know, God places people in our lives to help and shape us, to give us advice and to provide confirmation when we're unsure of the path ahead. And these relationships are really crucial, especially in seasons where we're seeking God's direction. However, it requires humility to ask for help, to admit that we don't have all the answers, and to be open uh, to the insights others bring. And as we've learnt, wise counsel doesn't just come from anyone. It comes from those who are aligned with God's heart and who genuinely want to uh, the best fear for us. You know, these are the people who will pray for you, speak truth into your life and help with, and help to you to discern the path that God is laying out for you. If you're in a place of transition or uncertainty right now, I encourage you to take the step back and to think about the people God has placed in your life. Who can offer godly counsel? And don't hesitate to reach out to them. Share your thoughts and struggles and invite them to pray with you as you seek clarity. You know, God, God often confirms his will through the community and their wisdom could be the very thing that brings you the direction that you've been searching for. So remember, it's not a sign of weakness. It's a seek, seek advice. It's a sign of wisdom. God works through relationships and he may use your counsel of others to reveal what is already stirring in your heart. Trust that he is faithful to guide you, both through his word and through his, his wise voices he has placed around you.